Okay guys, this video is Boogeyman 1 CTR for challenge on try hack me. There is a difficulty medium and uh, we got um, a new treat actor emerges from the world using name Boogeyman. Are you afraid to Boogeyman? So there is a name for Boogeyman. We got some things. Let me read for you and um, Alright, here got on a pre regardless we have to be doing phishing analysis, fundamental tools, Windows event logs, and Wireshark traffic analysis. We got it here. So, start mission button and um, use Thunderbird link parse 3. What is link parse 3? Okay, open link in new tab. Use Wireshark, T Shark, and GQ is here to effectively parse and analyze. Provide the artificates. You may also use built in command line tools such as grab, set, awq, and base64. Now let's start hunting the boogeyman. Alright, let me go first of all the email analyze. Look at the headers. So here we got um, email analyzer tweets. I think it's Thunderbird. So it will be fine. The boogeyman is here. Juliana, a finance employee working for Quick Logistics, received follow up email regarding an unpaid invoice from the business partner. Be peacocking and rusty here, he touched the document with malicious and compromised her workstation. There is another malicious mail is here. There is another phishing mail. And that's that's name is dump the email like that. So let me go up before advocates here. Open the advocates and um, dump the email. Right, dump that email. Open with there's a Thunderbird. Yeah, Thunderbird mail is over here. Let me open it. So try to get an um, email analysis. So email analysis is really cool things of cybersecurity because there's a too many companies in, in the world and a too many phishing attacks to our company. If someone has no the idea for this phishing attacks for an employer in the company, so that means or you have to be doing the email analysis for for what company works. All right, here, let me open this first question. What is email address used to send phishing email? All right, there is a from Arthur Griffin. You know, here there's an um, use it send phishing email. There's an Arthur Griffin a Griffin at bpackaging.xyz. So what is email address the victim? The or victim is Juliana Westcott and the Juliana Westcott's mail is Juliana Westcott is here hotmail.com. So what is named the third party mail relay services used by attacker based on DKIM signature and the list ask unsubscribe headers? All right, all right. Here, I think. Let me go. There is an um, zip file. I think we have to be save it. All right, save it in um, desktop artificates and um, save it. All right, cool. There is an um, invoice that zip file. We there is an um, invoice of zip file is a um, malicious file. And then um, the another things here you can use. Um, what is name of third party mail relay service used by attacker based on DCAM signature list ask unsubscribe headers? Alright, let me go more. And um, here I think we have to be used with source. Alright, let me go with source. There's a time information I think we have to be get it. So yeah, there's that's cool. Alright. I'm gonna be like that using like I wanna be using like that. There's too many things, but we can do some things. All right, there are other things here. I think now, cool. All right, the, before I do this, I wanna be go elastic. Now invoice dot zip here. And that uh, invoice the link is here, but what is password? We have no idea the password. Or right, I'm gonna be cancel it and um, go for Thunderbird one more time. And um, yeah, 
in the net. So there is an uh, what is the name of third party? All right, okay. Let me scroll, close the tabs, and um, hi Julian. I hope you're well. I just wanted to drop your quick notes, remind your respect documents for payment January. It would be grateful if you could confirm everything on your track for payment. For additional information, kindly see attached documents. So it's coming from B packagings for victim is a B packagings X Y Z. That's cool. And um, is there an anything we have to be good? Let me thinking about it. No. All right. Let me close tabs and um, open source file alright cool I'm gonna be maximize for this file and waiting for it that's cool so I'm gonna be up alright receive it from at and um the outlook.com office yeah like that using smdp protocol okay uh let me scroll down here all right here i think we have to be looking for griffin date friday message id is here and um, replay to R2 Griffin, Sandra Griff Griffin. Alright, let me scroll down one more like that. Um, okay. Is there? Alright, alright here. Yeah, cool. We got it. So. Let's unsubscribe here, right? Yeah, unsubscribe headers. But we can use controller F here and um, D, like finding page, D key I'm and um, dash. Not um, when we use dash, yeah, let me use dash. So in the DKM signature is over here, and DKM signature is using API, relaxed, it's simple, but. Um, for ask unsubscribe headers, we have to be look it. All right, all right, cool. Now is a uh, DKM signature headers file. There is an um, elastic email dot com they are using. So that's as first is elastic email. So what is what is the name of the file inside encrypted attachments? All right, there is an there is something's encrypted. Really, all right. Let me delete all of it and um, there is too many things encry with encrypted. But um, what we're using for it? Name of file inside encrypted attachments. All right, there's a something in encrypted attachments in the zip file, I think. So let me close the tabs. And um, the what's password encrypted attachment? All right, cool. I'm gonna be use um, yep, toner mail, and um, close the tabs, and um, go for Kaja invoice.zip there's an invoice.zips encrypted attachment is invoice under dash yeah here you can you can see it so there's an, I think we have to be try some things for like um, in the Thunderbird they are giving they are giving us before so if you, if you go for on your let me cancel it and um, no, like that, All right? Go Kaja and dump email with open with Thunder Thunderbird mail. There's an um. You may use this code with the encrypted file invoice twenty twenty three. So that means I think this is password the zip file um twenty twenty three in invoice twenty twenty three. All right. Okay. 
and uh, error wrong password. Really? All right, let me do it one more time. All right, close the tabs and go occasion one more time. Invos.zip. All right, I'm gonna be use terminal. I think that's that's that will be fine too much. All right, I'm gonna say cd um desktop. There's um okay. I'm gonna say desktop. There's no home. I got it. Desktop ls and cd artificates. I'm gonna say ls one more time and I'm on zip. invoice.zip so password is invoice 2023 with this I'm gonna say less yeah there is an invoice yeah here invoice 2021 or something like that zip so that means or what's the password encrypt that attach means our invoice 2023 so there's an in link for us could not display a moment to artificate just like that. So, all right, I'm gonna say uh, okay. Based on result, the link purse tools what is encoded payload for command line arguments file. So there is an absenting the code file here. I think so our, there's a link file you can show about it, but they give us our something so for it. So I think we have to be use link purse here and um, select invoice under dash like that and link so there's an um some all right common line arguments like that we got um, encoding some things now there's an encoder all right there's a uh, answer to this question because there's already encoding but if you if you want to be go over here the cyber shaft or you can use um, different things if you want basics for encoding codings or something like that oh is there anything all right cool i'm gonna be deleted and um, do it there's nothing so that means or maybe you have to be go from base 64 and these are bullshit you can you can look over here but if you want to go here, base 64 encode and decode online, there's an some too many encoders over here. So you can use this on a decode file, that is bullshit. So that, that means or the or as for is over here, um, this, this, this things, this stuff. So the, we got the email and all, this, all of things that we got to do like that is cool. So it's time to go and point security. Are you sure that's invoice? That is um, endpoint security. Are you sure that's invoice for I'm um, getting some PowerShell and with using the GQ tools over here because the GQ tools is transferring with the JSON file and the JSON file is in the if you're thinking about the website there's a JavaScript or robots TX3 readme the media and then the JSON file too many so that means or maybe we have to be using phone on the GC. Um, that means or maybe we have to be go one more time artificates cd desktop and um, cd artificates ls one more time yeah there's an yeah there's a powershell.json file and we work with this that's cool in investigation guide with the following discoveries, we should now proceed with analyzing the PowerShell logs and cover the potential impact of attack. So, using previous findings, we can store or analyze or searching execution the insult payload in the PowerShell logs. Since the given data in JSON, we can parse it clearly I using the GQ commands. Note that some logs are redundant and don't do do, do not contain any critical information, hence can be ignored. GQ chassis. There's an that's really cool because the GQ chassis they're already giving us. Uh, we don't need the uh, uh, we don't need to get a surging some things. It's uh, it's it will fine. So GQ is a lightweight uh, flexible command like JSON processor. Okay, this tool can be used. Conjunction with the other text processing commands, 
you may use the following table as guide in pressing logs in this task. Note, you must be familiar with this accessing file as a single log. Alright. The pairs all JSON be bit file the output to print all values from specific file without printing the field like this, like here, like this. Okay. Let me say what are the domains used by attacker for file hashing C2. Provide the domains or alphabetical order. Alright, cool. I'm gonna be clear it. So it's time to go PowerShell JSON. So that's a parse all JSON into bit file output. Okay, let me try cat. PowerShell JSON with um, like that GQ yeah like that now is is there any problem no it's because we do PowerShell no it's a PowerShell JSON yeah all right I think there is nothing tools we can be using so I'm gonna say I'm gonna be maximized for our terminal so um let me go up scroll up yeah what are domains all right we we looking for domains and that means or we can use controller shift f for find something here let me define tabs take over here and um you know there's an um we got before the thunderbirds they are using x y z uh with um with their email so that means or we can use x y z here to get emails so i'm gonna say enter for x y z to find them um, there is an um lines lines b packaging all right let me do find one more time is there is it working yeah there's an um, files there's a files b packaging xyz there's the first things we have to be looking for it and that's cool why i'm talking about so let me do one more time but before do it save it on your notes files dot b pack caging xyz no it's xyz that's cool so the another email is over here and I'm, I'm sorry the domain is over here let me do it one more time to get a hint for find all right files yeah there is an um, cdn yeah here cdnb pack caging xyz cdn dot b pack caging xyz so if you are reading here, provide the domains or alpha alphabetical order. Or that means or we have to be using alphabetical order is over here. So we can use CDMB packaging XYZ first and um, here files be packaging XYZ there from second one. So what is name of the animation tool developed by attacker so we are looking for now uh animation tool download for attacker so i'm gonna do attacker mis mistakenly executed for execute tool name you know there is an attacker using some um using some uh tools for getting uh, fishing so it's now our aims to find it it's cool let me close all close tabs and um if you're reading here there's an um all right i'm gonna say Control shift f one more time and um, i'm gonna show you something guys so if you are hit y one more time to find there's a script block text and that's cool because there's an um or file so i'm gonna be save it like here all right what is it or file i'm gonna say or file is equal to script uh, block and text yeah script block text they are using script block text so that's cool i think i'm gonna be close window now so I'm gonna say enter for getting the up, down, and clear all of it. So I think it's time to go for using 
print all values from specific files in without the printing files. That's really cool. And uh, I'm gonna use one more time cats, PowerShell, JSON, and I'm um, using like that, and uh, GQ. Um, time to give secrets, right? This is a secret, right? All right, let me, yeah, secrets block text. I'm gonna say secret block text. Yeah, like that. And um, Jiggy command now file. All right, let me use uh, with dot. No, Jiggy command now file. It's not working again. All right, let me add this uh, for, yeah, here. All right, I'm gonna be use it here. I'm gonna be script block text here, but is um, now GQ or is a GQ or, uh, oh my goodness, man. I'm sorry for it. All right. All right. Um, now we find something. I think so what is the name of enumeration tool? Or there's an, um, some enumeration tool they are using, but they are bullshit. Let me go up. And um, yeah, you can see is over here. Secrets block tags is a um, IX new object and new web client. They are using download strings is over here. And the download strings is from GitHub, HTTPS, GitHub.com, PowerShell Pass, Liblob Master, and um, set belt PowerShell one. And then that means or the attacker using star tool is set belt, and set belt is answer of it. So the another question is, what is the file? Accessed by attacker using download and ask you three the X binary provide the full wild path escape it with backslashes with using backslashes all right I'm gonna say enter one more time to getting down so it's time to using clear it for here so um, now we got some things for or with some um, all right let me here and uh, all right like that, yep. Now, if if you remember, we got some things with uh, our file, and our file it's equal to secrets block tags. And then now it's time to go secrets block tags. We grab some things because when we grab some things with a CQ3 exe, we got to find some things from CQ2 exe here. So that means or maybe we have to be using here. I'm gonna try. But I have no idea. Maybe it's not working, but I I I. Up this so let me go here and I'm um, using that um, grab all right sq3 the exe nope nothing yet all right ask it for the exe yeah we got it so this is script block text using music's backslash backslash sq3 the exe and then this uh, binary is from here app data local package Microsoft Microsoft sticky notes and plum escalate like here so you have to be using copy this and um, like that and um, copy this and um, come over here now our binary is it but um, you have to be read it provide the full file path with escaped backslashes that means or we have to be using the where is app data for thinking about the app data is looking for in the um, C file using backslash because they uh, it gives us escape it with backslash and um, no, like that, yeah, here, C, backslash, backslash, and users, like that, and backslash, backslash, and G dot, now G dot West code is already here, I think, yeah, G dot West, the West code, because the user here, you can, you, you can find it here, the what use West code, so, copy all of it and um, when you copy and uh, paste here that's you can use uh, press back to see the commands all right you can show your answer is correct all right what is software that user file in q3 is that that means or something like here all right 
Um, when you get the cat partial JSON with grab the SQL3 exe, they are using some Microsoft sticky notes. You can show it over here, and that's that's as for is Microsoft sticky notes. What is name of explorated file? All right, um, time to go some somewhere. Protected on dash. What is next? Is a uh, using for timestamps. Or something like that. Or going for again this. Yeah. Let me use it. And uh, with GQ. Alright. And now it's the question is what is name of explorated file? Alright. I'm gonna be entered now and clear all of it and do it one more time. So we can use some things for explorated file to get up. Let me go up, 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 up. 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 Let me go up. Yeah, here, like there. Okay. There's an um, I have new. <coughs> All right, sorry. All right, there you set belt. Another things that I think we have to be using so for getting. Not so well now. Okay. Looking for down. Yeah, here is um script block text. Um, CD and uh, B packagings X Y Z and A D A D. Invoke web broadcast and URI. I think this is really important for us. All right, let me let me scroll down to more. If there is any cool things, we have to be cut it now. We done nothing now. All right, there's a too many script block tags here. Yep, files put. Yeah, we got the file protected data dot kdbx here and using this IP address so the another thing so what is type of users kdbx file extension as it types all right let me say control shift F and I'm using kdbx like that now another things here let me all right Documents. All right. Find one more time. I think here. All right. Find. Nope. Do it. Nope. All right. I think it's time to doing with um KDBX. Right. All right. I'm gonna be clear all of it. Uh, here clear and um, use it with grab the kdbx and um, enter it. Yeah, there is a um, kdbx file is uses the kdbx for extensions. Alright, it's it's it's. All right. What is the type of file? All right. Let me go for chat GPT. Maybe it's like a search things. All right. Login. Let me login in. All right. Ask it.
password key pass all right key pass this that's pass all right that's uh as for its key pass what is encoding user trying to expiration attempt for a sensitive file i think there is a you have to be uh, try some things because i got it but i do not i do not know things there's a hack stomp or something like that just Try it. What is tool uses for exploration? There's a, just one tools for exploration, and there's an NSS NS lookups. So we got the all of it on endpoint security. I think it's time to go network traffic analyze. They got us call back immediately. Based on PowerShell logs investigation, we have seen the full impact of attacks. The traitor actor was able to end exploit with potential sensitive files. The domain under and ports are used for network activity for discovered, including the tool or user or trait actor for exploration. Investigation guide. Finally, we can complete investigation guide understanding when network traffic caused by attack and utilize the domains or ports on discovered from the previous tasks. All commands executed by attacker will come out will be logged and stored in a packet capture. Follow the streams of the notable command discover the PowerShell logs and based on the PowerShell logs we can retrieve the contents of accelerated data by understanding how it was encoded or extracted. Alright, what, uh, what software is used by attacker host the premise of payload server? I think it's time to go PCAM file get alright um I'm gonna close all of it here. All right, let me open Kaja. All right, close the tabs, close window, close all of it, and just go Kaja. And then um, there is a capture tab, P can, P can and G here. So open P can and G with Y shark and do it something now. Alright, I'm waiting for it. Now let me read hint. Review the headers of the HTTP request going to the server hosting malicious files used by attacker. Alright, capture P can and G one more time, but alright, cool. It's open now. It's really slow. Yep, there's an Y shark. There's just one tab, right? Yeah, it's cool. All right, let me go Y shark. I think we have to be use. Okay, close all tabs. We have to be file extension. We have full screen because uh, Y shark is really tabs are like that. All right, here I think time to go Y shark and. Uh, what is software is used by attacker the host presumed file payload server all right let me say here http not like that all right http not like that okay http like that so there is an some um, chrome web store but uh, we have to be adding anything like that http dot host is equal to um B key pack like that, yeah. Not me. Yeah, B packaging. B packaging dot X Y Z like that. Yeah, it's will be fine. Now it's now it's now working. All right. I'm gonna use C D N. Is it C D N or C G N? All right. Let me read it. Yeah, here. It's a CDN. All right. Yeah, here. CDN dot B packaging X Y Z. All right. So now use. I'm gonna say eighteen, eighteen, and um, nothing to find. All right. Let Let me just go for HTTP dot host. Just say HTTP. 
Yeah. All right. But there's a two many things. Yeah. Yeah. Here, for example, text plane or heat file is here. Is a time to go at. I'm gonna use follow HTTP stream for it. Okay. Yeah. There's there's not too many options. They they have to be using Python, JavaScript. Now it's just using Python, Go, Perl, and um, Python, Go, Perl, Elegant, or something like that. But we have to be looking for it. I think there's not uh, that's not meaning so fit. All right. I want to be use my in network. All right, let me scroll uh, down, down. All right, let me go back one more time. Now there's too many things. Oh shit. Can we enter in the or Cal Linux? Or right, let me try it. And um, here I'm map using map scan for getting shell. I think there's another thing that um, we can in install or because it's so slow, I cannot use it. It's fucking slow. And now I want to be use my full network connections. All right. Waiting for a map scan. And um, come over here one more time. HTTP house CD and B packagings XYZ AD and AD port. Right, enter it. It's not working. Okay, just using like that. But, um, that's not meaning. HTTP one more time yeah, like that yeah we got something but um yeah, JavaScript let me try Java secrets, but there's Java secrets. Nope, no, incorrect. All right. Let me scroll up. All right, length. Now info. I want to be used post. I I actually I want to be used post. All right, here the posts. All right, cool. Um, press and HTTP. Scroll. Uh, post. Yeah, here here the posts. 
All right, we got a post. I'm gonna say follow HTTP stream is here. What is it? I wanna be copy this. Copy and go cyber chef. Windows system thirty two. Okay. CDM be packaging XYZ Windows PowerShell. Alright. Um here I think we can yeah, HTML from URL encoded. Um hypertext transfer controller TCP segments nope not TCP transmission control protocol Okay Oh, it's um giving some directory. I think okay. Let me go. All right. There is an um eighty port, twenty two port, and then eighty port go. Y'all, y'all. <laughs> WebSock five Python. Oh, is there WebSock? All right, here. Oh my goodness. Just do it with MMAP scan. <laughs> what HTTP method is C to output commands executed by attacker? The attacker using post because of it. Yeah, here. Let me. Yep, here is a um, HTTP using the length is 283 and I'm um, using post. All right, cool. We got it. That's really cool. What is protocol user drinks the exploration activity? Protocol. Um, HTTP and SSH here. All right, let me try SSH like that. Nope. TCP. Nope. Get. Nope. All right. Let's find it. Just find it. Disgusting. Alright. Um, what is protocol user during exploration activity? Alright, let me go here and um, protocol TCP. Now TCP stream EQ like that. They are using. Alright. I'm gonna be say. Like here. Delete it. All of it and enter now delete all of it so protocol is http and all right http tcp yeah they're just using http and or yeah they're using DNS all right cool uh, we find that DNS what is password explorated file the password is stored in database for access that you can use SQ the three exit all right I think it's time to go DNS right all right let me go DNS here um bpad cadgings like that all right let me go say follow UDP stream It's empty All right, um I think we have to be looking for sq3 x right? Yep What is credit card number stored in Excel file and I'm looking for PowerShell logs? All right, I got it. I have some idea Um can we looking for here 
No, where is um file no add it find packet and um clear all of it I think so we have to be clear it and um we have to be looking for sq3.exe no it's not working I, I want to be close Wireshark and um, open one more time. Capture PK and NG here. So it's file now. File edit and find previous. I I want to be used to find packet. The packet name is sq3. Exe. No, nothing that. Alright, let me close it and the cancel. Alright, I'm gonna go find next. Maybe it's work. SQ3.exe. That means our VI have to be using. Cancel it. Add it, find previous. Or right, let's try it. SQ3.exe. No, it's not working. All right. I think. I think we have to be find packet and um, display strings, packet details. And um, say ASCII three dot exe. I like that, like that, yeah. Yeah, there is an we got light, yeah, here. Let me using like that yeah there's a line file as key dot exe pwd and um all right let me find one more time HTTP find one more time all right find and uh, find yeah there is some things Marcus sticky nuts to select from a limited chance use and um, it's looking for like that like I'm cheating here actually. Alright, what they are doing it? Yeah, here they are using posts. Alright, what they're doing? Let me. HTML looking alright. From item is item is here. Alright, copy. Copy value. Yep. From item, yeah, here, let me copy it and go for cyber chef. And um, I'm gonna be deleted. Master password. What is password? A 
okay. Uh, here, not like here, here. Now, what is password? How did you do it? Oh, it's all right, close it and um, Copy it and go for one more time in here. Alright. I think it's time to copy it. Copy this and um, Control R and Yep. The password is here, right? Okay, we got password. Oh my goodness, we got password. It's cool. Now it's what is credit card number stored in the X Florida file? It read X for first string T shark. I think we have to be using T shark here. So let me do it and uh, okay. Um, I I this is this will be fine part one and um, the another with credit card number strong this fire will be part two okay see you guys